Hi, this is Steve from SynthroTech, and uh, right now I'm showing you um, our completed kit version of the PT2399 Lo-Fi Delay. Um, right now we're ship we can ship these out in this form where there's a case, and uh, basically there's going to be case mount uh, plugs, uh, 9 volt connection, and uh, potentiometers versus our older kits were more of a surface mount product. So um, this is more of what it can look like. It's kind of fancy, it's a little, uh, it's sexy. Um, we're using eighth inch jacks, but you can use uh, quarter inch if you like, or what have you. Uh, it is a center negative nine volt adapters with these takes, but if you're building the kit, you can probably build it either any way you want to. So first thing we're gonna do is um, I'm gonna plug in my delay using my AC adapter. You also could use a nine volt when you're putting it together if you want to. Um, I'm gonna be using this with one of our Atari pump consoles that I've built, and just so we can get a full idea of kind of the fun that we can make with this product. Uh, next step here would be to uh, take the output of my Atari pump console, plug it into the input on my delay, then plug the output of the delay into my amplifier, which is down here. Then I'm gonna turn on, turn on my Atari Punk console and have some fun. So the first uh, element we have on the uh, delay kit here, on the delay, uh, well, I guess it's the completed delay in this case, uh, is a speed and mix. I've turned the mix all the way up so that you can really hear the effects of what this uh, pedal or modular synth editor can do here. Um, if I turn it all the way over to the uh, the left counterclockwise, I'll notice that it's a really, uh, really, really short, short delay. So we can turn that up and kind of hear it. It's very short, but as we move it over clockwise, you notice that. So as you notice, you can get some real spacey sounds. One thing I like to do is I like to actually adjust on the fly both the speed and my knobs here on the Atari Punk console. What that allows me to do is get some really funky stuff. As you're, as you're adjusting the speed on there, it uh, tries to catch up and it sounds really, really uh, fun, weird, and bizarre. And so let's try to mess around with that for a second. <laughs> Almost get some THX kind of sounds on there that are doing so. A lot of fun stuff you do there. You can go crazy and mess around with it. Fun. This could be connected to pretty much anything, guitar, or really any other device that kicks out a uh, frequency. Um, I'm going to show another sample here using uh, my DS10 software, the Nintendo DS system. That'll be another video. So check out the system. We're going to get a little zoom in here on the fun and some more sounds to leave you with. But this is with the Atari Pump console. A lot of fun, spacey stuff. Yeah. 